An opposition protest march winding its way from Ankara to Istanbul is now entering its final stretch. Tens of thousands have taken part in the so-called March for Justice, which began on June the 15th. This opposition figure told Euronews the arrest of an MP was the straw that broke the camel's back. That's why we started this movement. From the beginning, we said this is not just about our party. This is for everyone who's seeking justice. There are many deputies, mayors, journalists and academics in jail, he says thousands of victims. The march has accused the government of trying to create a one-party state in the wake of a failed coup last year, using powers under a state of emergency. Of course, we know we won't have democracy and justice in Turkey at the end of this march, he says, but we'll continue to protest against this anti-democratic way that Turkey is headed, in the parliament, in the streets, every civilian platform. Platform, without violence in a peaceful way. The head of the CHP party has lodged an appeal with the European Court of Human Rights over a vote in April that granted President Erdogan more powers.